Hey there fellow developers, I hope you all are doing great. So welcome back to my channel. So I've already told you that in this playlist, we're going to talk about 10 days of JavaScript from hackerrun.com and we are going to solve these problems one by one. So we have already solved the day zero problem, which is hello world in our the last video. So we are going to solve this problem which is data type. So I'm going to take you there. So before you start your coding, please read objective tasks, input format and output format so that you can solve this problem really easily. So in this problem, we have to do three things. So in the left side of this space, you can see variables named first integer, first decimal, first string are already declared for us in the editor here you can see here you can see these already are mentioned we have to use the plus operator to perform uh, these following uh, following operations firstly we have to convert the first integer to an integer number and then we have to sum it with the variable which is called first integer and then print the result on the new line using console.log so here you can write your code so we have to type console.log and here we have to use this plus operator use this plus operator to sum up these two variables and we have to sum up first integer we have to sum up first integer first integer with the second integer variable so we have to convert this second integer variable into a uh, integer number type so you can use first int to convert in to an integer number type variable so we have to just uh, type purse purse int and we have to just pass this variable which is called second integer second integer and okay we are done with this line so next we have to convert the second decimal to a floating point number so you can write your code here so it, you have to just type console.log and then you have to sum up with first decimal use the plus operator and you can use purse float and you have to just pass second decimal variable okay so we are done with this line so in the last line we have to use another console.log another console.log and then we have to sum up first in first string with and we have to sum up the first string with another variable which is called second string okay so now we can run our code here i hope this code will run perfectly and here you can see our code has passed the sample test case so please submit the code and you can move to the next problem okay so i'm going to wrap up this video here so please like share and subscribe to my channel so thank you everyone have a good day